So last Halloween, they immediately announced a new Bendy game called Bendy the Cage, which is not confirmed to be Bendy 3, or quote unquote a small spin-off. But however, it does take place sometime in the events of Bendy in the Dark Revival, which follows the story on how Henry and the other Psycho Breakers escaped the pit. And you want to take a guess of who we are playing in this new game? That's right, Henry Stein. The same person we played as in Betty the Ink Machine, which I don't think any of us has touched after Dark Revival's release, unless you're going for achievements, that is. So recently, the immediately gave YouTuber Super Horror Bro an exclusive teaser that he shared on his Twitter and YouTube channel. And my god, it looks insane. And in this video, I want to break down this insane looking teaser. The teaser image shows what looks to be a lost one with a bear trap on his head and some red demonic fuse stuff that looks very interesting. Now, we are commenting this guy, as you can see, we're looking through him through Henry's point of view. Very simple image to look at, right? But what is that red demonic stuff on him, and what or who does that connect to? Well, there are a few guesses I have that could connect. The first connection is that this is a different type of Lost One group, which I'll explain later in this video. Or, this Lost One could have been tortured by Wilson using that weird color stuff we saw in Chapter 5 for redesigning the cycle, which is probably why that guy has that red stuff on him. Or, this is a really dumb guess, he's probably in rage mode whenever he sees us, just like the Keepers, and whenever they see us, they glow red. Now, I don't think the Lost Ones turn red whenever they go insane because in Dark Revival, they remain their normal outside look when they attack us, so it's a pretty stupid possibility. My next guess would have been that some Lost Ones were tortured in the pit by Wilson if they break any of the rules Wilson has put out for them. And this is what happens when they break those rules. <laughs> now, all the rule or psycho breakers have, probably have different torture methods. This guy in the teaser just got a bear trap on his head, and who knows what the others might have gotten. My last connection is my favorite one, and that is that this is a different type of Lost One group. Lost One group? Different types? Excuse my English. Now, let me explain what I mean by this. We've got the normal Lost Ones, and the versions with the Mohawks. The two groups follow two different rulers, or followers, whatever you want to call them. The normal Lost Ones ruler, or follower, the one they look up to, is Wilson. They praise him, and believes he knows their purpose. The Mohawks guy's ruler is- <laughs> Lord Fuck <laughs> Yes, apparently I'm the new Lord Amok, but I still get attacked by my followers for creating terrible laws, so... yeah. Anyways, these red-fused demonic-looking Lost Ones could possibly be following someone we've never seen in the Bendy universe. I'm talking about a new main antagonist. Who is it? We don't know. It could be Wilson, the Ink Demon, which I doubt, or someone completely new. Someone giving certain Lost Ones a different and special demonic power, and that bear trap is a trophy of some sort that they all wear. If they are going for a new character for the main antagonist, he or she better be the most terrifying person in the entire studio. That's all to say about the strange guy who is featuring the new Bendy teaser image, but what about the environment? Now, it's clear that the environment takes place in the train tunnel, as in we're probably going to go for the city during our escape from the pit. There is something I want to point out, is that it's the color palette in Bendy the Cage. It's different from Bendy the Dark Revivals, if you've noticed. It has the same color scheme that Bendy the Ink Machine's chapters 1, 2, and 5 has, which is I find a huge W. What I think what happened was that the Beatly saw all the criticism on the color palette for Bendy the Dark Revival and changed it for Bendy the Cage to match the color palette for Bendy the Ink Machine. Anyways, that's all I have to say for this teaser image, but I do hope Bendy the Cage has a darker storyline than Bendy the Dark Revivals, even if the game is shorter than Dark Revival, but regardless, I'm really looking forward to this game, and I'll see you next time.